What's up, everyone? I just want to do a quick summary of what's going on this week with the markets. We're going to take a look at everything uh, from crypto to um, uh, uh, indices to gold. And I just want to point out something interesting. So first of all, uh, the uh, the indices uh, are already uh, pulling back from the post uh, CPI rally. We're starting to make higher, uh, lower lower high and lower lows so the there is a change of character and we might pull back even deeper so yeah, it's uh, it's like that or at least we're doing sideways consolidation the reason why we're doing sideways consolidation because the only thing that's propping the risk markets up and uh dollar still also uh not uh creating a pullback for post cpi sell-off uh, is because the 10-year well, the yields overall are still dropping aggressively. And where are they dropping? Well, they're dropping to, if you go to daily and you draw a simple uh, FIBS, I think the, this is the target. They're going to 38.2. So while the FIBS, oh, FIBS <laughs> while the, uh, the yields are still dropping, and today during uh, our Discord uh, session, I was talking about how uh, we are uh, taking out these lows and uh, we we have to be nimble with all the trades we're taking um, because it doesn't take a genius to see that, for example, gold is extremely overbought. I mean, you can't even find a rally like that uh, previously, such a strong rally without a pullback. We had similar similar rally like that here and you can see how it pulled back. So same thing here. Gold is stalling. Uh, Euro is stalling, all those uh, dollar pairs are stalling pretty much. And uh, the reason why they're stalling is because they want to pull back. They want to pull back lower because this, they are grossly overbought. The momentum is showing the, that it's waning uh, momentum, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, as, you can, as you can see, uh, my, massive divergences, ma massive, massive divergences hitting up uh, uh, resistances, auto block resistances around number 120. For example, in, in the case of British pound, um, and the only reason that they're not pulling back is because the yields still need to hit that uh, the minimum 38 to retracement level, uh, which are coming up. And that's why all day today we haven't done much in anything else, but the yields are still dropping. So by tomorrow, we're going to be there and that will be enough, maybe catalyst to start producing a bounce. Uh, today, we've uh, I've traded uh, in our. Uh, signals group, for example, we've been, uh, I took an L uh, in pound. So yesterday was the uh, 26 pip. All right. So uh, euro 26 pip minus 35 on pound plus five on the dollar yen. Then uh, we took um, 45 pips on euro and uh, 70 points on NASDAQ short because basically you have to be nimble. I, you don't want to overstay your welcome for now. Uh, because again, they try to sell off, but the yields are propping these markets up. So it's important to watch the yields for now. And I think the, the second we're going to see them hit, uh, the, the, uh, 38, two, uh, I'm, I'm not saying that this is where they're going to bottom, but I'm saying that we're going to, this is going to be the minimum retracement level where at least it's going to allow for a uh, dollar to start rallying again and uh, gold stocks and other currencies to pull back. Uh, ultimately, this is a, you know, uh, a top, uh, topish, uh, um, uh, inverted, uh, not inverted, a head and shoulders pattern. And if you tar, if you run it to the target, you're going to get pretty much like 50% retra retra retracement level, or at least these swing lows here as a target. So, we're at work. Uh, so again, for for uh, tomorrow, I think we're gonna tap the thirty-eight-two, maybe a little lower, but then we're gonna essentially do this. We're gonna sell off into the uh, support, and then we're gonna produce a bounce, a recovery bounce, which will allow markets to overwork their overbought conditions in the stock indices, gold, and uh, uh, all the currency pairs against U.S. dollar. And we'll be able to uh, trade that pullback. Uh, if you want live signals and all that jazz, more than welcome to stop by apexbull.com. Also, our Discord, uh, we trade live um, 
sharing screen and taking all the trades live as well. So more than welcome to stop by uh, our Discord and uh, view our screens while we're trading. There's seven traders uh, all trading different stuff from currency to swing swing trading to to a short term uh, five minutes chart trading, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So more than welcome to stop by, say hi, learn a thing or two in the process. All right, hope it helps. Enjoy.